small update on the 123D. Found the source of the knocking. We've got two new front arms on it and we're currently waiting on a drop link. So this on both sides has been replaced and we're just waiting on that drop link. I was concerned that it might have been the shocks, but thankfully just replaced these. We'll get that drop link on it. Job done. Finding more and more stuff with this car. You see, typical with BMW alloys, they crack. This one's been cracked before, but they've, rather than getting it welded, they've put bead sealer on it. I mean, it does the job, it doesn't leak, but... Ghetto fixes on a ghetto car. Right. These wheels are getting sold anyway, so I'm not bothered. <laughs> Got the same things in his shed of a Merc. <laughs> Got the drop link in. So, that's getting done now. Got Patrick on the job, my G. Sherry left his minstrels, so of course we don't want these to go out of date. So, being the good friend that I am, gonna eat them. It's only right. There we go. One, two, three is done back on the ground I was just waiting on Saint getting this thing finished we'll reseat that tire on the other side and then good to go right ah there we go that's much better obviously the clutch is still totally shot so that'll be getting changed this weekend but no more knocking no more banging it's totally sorted in that sense. Oh, it feels a lot better. Happy with that. That's one job off the list for this thing, getting it closer to being a much more zen worthy car. So next on the list we'll be getting the clutch, flywheel, slave cylinder done. Once that's all done, then hopefully we should be able to figure out what the issue is in terms of how this thing is running. Because it's quick, but it's not quick enough. It's nowhere near as fast as a 123D should be. It, I mean, fair ease, it's on 240,000 miles, but even then, it's still, it, to me, it feels kind of 120D sort of performance. There's a lot of low down lag, which these are not supposed to have. So I think there's possibly a boost leak. So we will investigate that when I've got some time and we'll be good. I've got another delivery in from Tegawa as well. The other one that we were waiting for. So I can show you guys that as well. That's gonna be interesting. Got a few parts here and there. So that'll be fun to go through. Progress again with the EG, it's going to be relatively slow but I've found, I found a company that's able to actually refurbish the calipers that I've already got so it saves me from having to try and source another pair and it, they're extremely reasonably priced. They're coming in at full refurbishment from what I've seen online their quotes are around around £215 to, to fully refurbish the wheels so, oh, not the wheels, sorry, the calipers can't, can't concentrate. So, we will, I'm going to get in touch with them. It's a company called Big Red. I don't know if anyone's heard of them, but apparently they are, they are very good at what they do. I had a lot of recommendations for them, so I'm going to send the calipers off to them. Uh, given that a new set usually comes in at around, well, a new used set comes in around £300, and the majority of them are recommended that they're rebuilt anyway so if i can get the ones i've got rebuilt for 215 pounds or whatever then i think uh, that's a bargain so yeah we'll be sending the calipers off to them and we'll see how it goes right on top of getting all the work done to the cars and stuff i have slowly been upgrading 
my PC setup. So I recently bought a new graphics card. So I bought a 2080 Ti, um, and it's absolutely insane. So it's, I had to do a full rebuild on my PC because what ended up happening was the 2080 Ti was too big to fit in the case that I had. I had a water cooler at the front of the case. So what I've done is I tried to move that to the top of the case. Uh, but then it turns out the case again was too narrow so it was hitting my RAM so what I ended up having to do was buy a new uh, case which I was pretty stoked that I managed to get myself a Corsair 4000D and I absolutely love the look of it so that is how it is looking at the moment uh, I'm only running 16 gig of RAM uh, but I've also <laughs> I've messed up the the cooler setup so these fans are actually supposed to be on the other underside of that so i'm gonna have to move them but by the end of it what i realized was i was left with uh well an old case an old gpu and uh, i've just bought these two new monitors as well so they're nothing really special it's more office setup because i use this more for office work than gaming anyway so I've upgraded to these, got them on a mount as well, so I've got more space on my desk. Uh, so now I'm left with a case, an old GPU, and two MSI gaming monitors. So the plan with them is I'm going to build my son a full gaming setup. So Keegan's going to be getting a full gaming setup. This opened a total can of worms because now I've been running about, I've been picking up uh motherboards cpus uh ram you name it like it's totally insane so i'm going to be doing a full pc build for him and his room currently doesn't have space for a pc so we're done up his bedroom as well we man's room is quite a mess it's got terrible light up here i don't know like, it's just totally useless. It doesn't even light up the room, like, at all. So, plan for this room is to get it fully redone. So, it's actually getting fully redecorated. This is how it looks right now. He, he's too big for this now. Like, a race car bed, he's just past that. I've got these awesome Marvel wall lights, which I will be taking off, and we will be moving them because they're too cool to just get rid of. So, his room is getting repainted, he's got all these figures and stuff, so what is going to happen? We've, he's going away for the weekend, so I just, God, look at that light, I think it's absolutely useless, it's, may as well not even be there, but yeah, so he's going away for the weekend, so while he's away, me and my wife are going to totally gut out this room gonna repaint it and uh we've i've went and bought him a gaming bed so we're gonna build him a gaming bed and then get the monitors set up i don't have all the parts yet for the pc so i'm gonna put as much together as i can uh, but we're gonna repaint the room gonna these cupboards have blue doors at the moment so we're painting his room like a kind of dark gray so i'm gonna paint the doors the same color uh so that that looks a wee bit cooler all his figures and stuff, the new bed has like shelving and stuff for that, so that's going to look absolutely awesome. And I'm really looking forward to seeing how it turns out. So I'm going to pop this on a time lapse and hopefully we'll be able to see Keegan's room really turn around. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Keegan's bed's taken apart. That's all done. I'm really unfit. Already huffing and puffing. Nuts. But we'll get this thing cleaned up, disinfected, ready for whoever decides to take it on. And then we will get Keegan's new light put in so that we can have some light while we're working. And we'll make a start on paint. Yeah. like crazy up here I didn't record everything uh, but to be honest we've got the majority of everything done however enough of that right um, my wife ended up doing the majority of the painting um, I've built Keegan's bed now uh, and we're at a point where it looks incredible don't get me wrong we've still got a whole load of stuff to do here I mean this place is still an absolute mess but his room looks incredible so I can't wait for him to see that looks so good. Zoom out a bit. There we go. So I've got two RGB lights at the back. Oh god, it looks so sick. So we got a new bedding, a whole new, pretty much new everything. So all those wee figures. He loves FGTV, so we've got all of them up there. His, all of his. What? FG. That's what I said. I said. I didn't say MGTV. I said FG. God. And I've got these, uh, all of his Marvel figures here. Uh, is I've given him my old MSI gaming monitors. So I mean, it's not connected or that yet. I've still got a whole load of stuff to buy for his, uh, for his PC setup. All of his old teddies and stuff. I don't know if this will maybe encourage him to to get rid of it, but <laughs> never know. Uh, I'm gonna use this corner for all of his wall lights. So he has all those, like for example, that Marvel one back there. He's got like Iron Man. Spider-Man, Hulk's fist, Thor's hammer, and stuff. So I think I'm gonna put them in this corner here. I think that'll look pretty cool. Uh, but everything all together, it just looks awesome. I love the fact that we painted these doors as well. That looks really good. And obviously got his boxing bag, punch bag back up. Uh, the new light looks great too. Don't know if you can see that. There we go. It's so much brighter than the old one. Um, obviously, uh, Aaliyah was helping us for the majority of the weekend and uh yeah some paint on the ground don't really know my wife said she says that she's able to to get rid of that but we'll wait and see right i will get rid of it mm -hmm. yeah, apparently she's got the tricks so yeah this this is awesome this is awesome i'm gonna gonna record keegan's reaction when he comes in here and uh yeah oh, god he's gonna be absolutely buzzing so yeah let's see how let's see what his reaction is Keegan, what do you think? Yeah, amazing. 
Have fun. Okay. Let's take you all we can. Yes, folks. Have fun. Let's we take your mom. Yeah, well, I mean, don't get me wrong, the computer is not set up yet. Alright, oh, because yeah, stop, stop, stop. I've not, we still need to get all the rest of the parts, but me and you will build it together once I've got all the parts together. And teach you how to put the computer together. This and, is going to be uh, weird sleeping here. Because knowing me, I'd wake up and think I'm in my normal bed. No, you're fine, buddy. You're going to fall on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> you'll be if, fine. You, if you hear off, fudge, you know it's me falling off. Yeah, but now everything is all... The light changes as well, and yeah, it's just the top! Oh, wow. I was hoping you would notice that. <laughs> I didn't notice that. that. Yeah. So it's a lot brighter, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. No, I mean, it's like really dull. Yeah. What do you think about the lights at the side of your bed? That's awesome. Yeah. You've got a controller as well. Yeah. You can control those lights, so you can change them. So we can change them to any colour you want. So look, that's, that's red there. We'll make this one red too. There you go. We'll go for them red and we'll make them yellow. And you can just move it around and you can put them back onto that and get them back onto RGB. There you go. It's pretty cool, right? Yeah. I've always said this. That was none of your business. That's what I'm doing. Now listen, this is because you've been working really hard. Alright, you've been doing really well at school recently. Okay? And we're really proud of you. So. This is for that, okay? Thank you. I'm actually going to This is amazing. Yeah, I was recording your reaction as well. Oh. So if you're going to cry, it's going to be, it's going to be on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> right, say bye to everyone here. Bye. <laughs> So Anaya was missing from this weekend. She was staying with my mum. So she's here now and she's really happy with her brother's room, right? You love it. Mm -hmm. You actually want to sleep in his room tonight, don't you? Yeah. I don't want you to. <laughs> what are you on about? You did want her to. Right. So, yeah. I mean, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a little bit different. Not the usual car stuff. At the end of the day, the channel's called Zen MHD. It's not called Zen MHD's cars and only that. So, yeah. It's a wee insight into my life what we do as parents for our kids when they're doing well and they deserve it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Keep subscribed, get subscribed if you want to see this PC build because I'll be recording that as well. And it's going to be pretty cool. So yeah, have a, have a look at what I've got. Take a look at the PC build. I've got more car parts coming in. So we've got a whole load of updates coming. One, two, three Ds, getting some work done to it right now. So yeah, I mean, it's going to be good. Like and subscribe, all the rest of that stuff. Say bye.